Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com. This is my daily stocks signals video for Wednesday, the first of May. So I'm going to bit a, a bit of a um, earnings play here on AVID. Now it doesn't have earnings till next week, but I want to be ready for this type of trade. It's a very cheap stock, uh, and with this cheap type of stock, volume can be low going into earnings, so it can be pretty range bound. But just in case there's a run into earnings, I want to put an entry and an order together. So first of all, I'm using our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the Think or Swim platform. It's also available for MT4, TradeStation, MultiCharts, and Ninja Trader. So let's have a look at this. This is a very rangy type of stock. We came from last earnings, actually gave us the, the boost up, and we had this Wave 3. We've had some profit taking against that Wave 3 now and seem to have found really good support at this previous resistance level. You can see here, this, is, this has been a very rangy stock for quite a while, but then we start to get better earnings and we start to get that momentum. If we get that same instance this time, we could see another nice push on AVID. So this is a four hourly chart. One thing we look at with the Elliott Wave to trade this fifth wave is the performance of the Wave 4. So first of all, the Wave 4 has pulled back into our automated probability zone. So this support in this green zone gives it an 85% probability it's going to go on and make a new Wave 5 high into our automated target zones up here around about $9.60. The next the way we look at the uh, the wave four is look at the performance using our Elliott Wave oscillator. That has to pull back between 90 and 140%, and it has done so and started to crown. The next subchart down in the middle there, we've got stochastic. Now this is our false breakout stochastic. This denotes a really strong bullish trend, and then it's pulled back against there, crossed over in the oversold zone, and it, it is most likely to want to return to that main bullish move. So all in all, this is setting up pretty well uh, for a potential fifth wave move. Now, I want to go outside uh, of the 6-4 moving average high, but I also want to go above this recent high pivot here. Uh, this high there was 8.09. So I've gone for an entry of 8.13 just to make sure I'm a good enough distance away from this rejection of this uh, bullish move up. The stop loss 7.38 below the wave fall low. And the target's around about $9.60, so it's a risk reward of one to two, even with a conservative entry. So good looking trade, not really looking for this to trigger until earnings. Now, it could do, could have a nice bullish run into earnings if there's some good rumors or anything like that. So I wanna put the order on right now because this is setting up. Obviously, if we get a further move down, we have to adjust our stop uh, but if we run out of risk to reward, we just cancel the order. But let's get it on uh, now just in case we get a nice run there. So this is AVID on the four hour time frame, looking for a fifth wave move long, entry 8.13. So that's it for today. Have a great trading day. Speak to you all tomorrow.